Hi, welcome to another video and today I'm going to be showing you some decorating tips with these blocks. So as you can see these are some new blocks added in the latest snapshot 18W44A. So they're pretty cool. Now I'm not going to go over like the um the stuff you can do with them. Actually, at the time of recording, they don't have any functionalities, but I know they will. But currently, but this video isn't about showing the functionalities of them and what they can do. I'm showing some decoration ideas you can do with them. So some ways that you can use these to decorate your house or yeah, or whatever you're making. So hopefully this video can help you. Uh, if you can't, well, I guess this isn't quite the right video for you. But hopefully it can help you with some decorating things. So first off, let's go over the blocks themselves. So we got barrels. With, as you can see, I named them all. You can't really see the names, but if you do this, you can kind of go over them. But point is, the first thing I'm going to go over is the barrel. So the barrel is just a block. <laughs> yeah, it's just a block. Uh, and you can change the way it, like... And then the bottom texture, because I, I flipped it around... The bottom texture has a kind of interesting texture. It's like a plank, but it's like outlined. But, uh, yeah, let's get that back to upright. Where, what? Okay, there's the upright. You can kind of also do it to the left turn, but I'll get to that later. But anyway, point is, that's a power. Next, we have the smoker. <laughs> and it is, a, uh, yeah, this is the, the block. And it has a kind of a, a back texture to it, too. You can make them, um, oops, that's not right. Uh, you can make them um, look, what? Okay, that's not right, okay. I thought, there we go, okay, that was good. Anyway, point is, you can uh, make them light up as well. No, that's not gonna work. You can make them light up as well. They have like a lit mode when you're, when you're, yeah, you're using it. Um, but yeah, like you can like light them up. It's kind of just how you like light up stuff, you know, but like. You can light these up as well, so it's cool. It kind of just like, hey, you know, you know, you light up furnaces, you can light up these, so whenever you use them. But yeah, that's, that's cool, you can light them up. You can't really kind of like, they don't, well, there's not really a way to right now, but they're probably, maybe when you're watching this video, there might probably as a way to use them and light them up. Anyway, next we have the cartography table, which is like a, Obviously, kind of goes with the cartographer, the villager, and this is the village and pillage update, so yeah, it makes sense. And it has like the what the cartographer sells is like the, the explorer maps, so like the ocean explorer and the woodland explorer map, and it has a map on the top, so that is really cool. And this doesn't have any like special modes like like these blocks. They don't have like special modes like that. Uh, but yeah, it's just the block, and it's just kind of obviously it's supposed to kind of like be a crafting table. I mean, not really, but. You're not really crafting this like where you put maps or something the next two are crafting tables like they have to be because they look like them uh but yes yeah, so that's the cartography table the the fletching table uh and the smithing table i don't actually have any designs for them because they're basically just like a crafting table just to use it the way you would decorate a crafting table so that's what these the cross out means like the barrier look thing like the thing it doesn't have a use for those the blocks because i don't i couldn't really think of one there there wasn't really a way i could use the i don't think there's a way i can use them very well so yeah anyway so the fletching table smithing table yeah next up is the grind stone so this is an interesting block and the weight can like get rotated and stuff it can be rotated like crazy and it can like change directions or something but yeah it can go like we and it can like turn around and stuff so yeah it, it can do a lot of things you can kind of like move around a lot and then but yeah and the stone cutter i kind of wish you could like rotate it so you know the oh yeah uh anyway i, I wish you could kind of rotate this so you could like know which way it's gonna go but it's good enough and there you might be able to do in the future but yeah as you can see it is a stone cutter <laughs> now we have the bell which uh anyway i'll get to that at the end of the video and when i go to the bell part but the bell the bell 
uh, and it has like a ceiling mode too so that would be attached to the ceiling but I kind of use like but yeah it can be on the ceiling as well and it will be able to go on the wall as well but not at the time of this video releases but anyway point is uh, the next thing is the lectern and it's just a uh, no it's kind of I think it's obviously kind of like supposed to be for like I don't know, like put a book on it and then everyone could read it and like if, if you've ever been in like a, a church hopefully have uh then you would see like the people like when they're like I don't know, you know, like, there's always one of these in there, so you'd be, like, sitting back here, and then sometimes there'll be someone up here talking and, like, reading something on there. So that's that's kind of, like, what that is. And then we got the loom. Now, this isn't actually 100% new. It was added in the last uh, two, wait, like, one, two, three, okay, well, the three snapshots ago it was added. The point is, well, since I'm recording the video, the point is, it's still a decently new block. And I haven't really done a decorating video on it before. So, yeah. This is going to be the video that shows all that. So, those are the blocks. Let's go on to some tricks and tips. Tips and tricks. What are you going to call it on these things? So, let's start the barrel. It's kind of self-explanatory. You just, like, make a barrel, you know. You got a normal barrel. They can <laughs> rotate or whatever. And you got a tipped barrel you got a small barrel a tiny tip or small tipped barrel and obviously you, know, you just have your regular just like pile of barrels but what i like about this is is the lectern which is you know the, the one of the block the bottom of it has it's an a kind of like an outlined the the lectern the bottom of the lectern is kind of like a which i'll get to later at the end of the video or close-ish to the end of the video i guess the lectern the bottom of it will have yeah, the bottom of lecterns has like an outlined wood block, and so does the barrel. The bottom of a barrel has this outlined wood texture, as I said before. But this is a little bit spruce-like, and this is a more oak-like. So you can make cool patterns on the ceiling. And weirdly enough, these, um, the, the lecterns can rotate. Uh, which is really cool how they can rotate and stuff. And I don't know why it's so laggy. I'm not like low on memory or anything, but it, like you can see what it was before, and now it's like so slow. I don't know what it's doing, but yeah, it should it should clear up soon, hopefully. Yeah, yeah, there we go, cleared up. I think. Well, whatever. I'll uh, hopefully I don't think I'll have any lag in the video. But point is, you can like. You can like rotate this, it's just kind of weird, but like cool too, and it, why is it lagging? Uh, snapshots probably or something. I mean, usually when I have this much memory, it doesn't lag out when I start to record, so I don't know what's going on, but point is you can kind of like rotate the, the tops, I guess you could say. So it's kind of funny, but like, yeah, um, is this facing? Okay, so the, yeah, the light, okay. Well, anyway, that, yeah, so that's the barrels. Pretty short one, I know, but there's not really much to them. They're very self-explanatory, and they will actually have uh, inventory space in the future, like this. Um, but yeah, so, but yeah, and the smokers, they'll kind of be like furnaces, I think. But yeah, and um, I also have like crafting recipes made for all of these. I'll do that after everything, um, and I can move the chests around. They keep their items, yeah. Anyway, or I'll, like, rotate the chest, but anyway. The, okay, so let's do the smoker thing. So, as you can see, it's this one that can light up and go make it lit. Uh, yeah, so this is the first idea, as well, just stoves. So, this, um, can I, you, so, obviously, this little black spot is a hole. That's where the smoke's coming out, but you can imagine it as just, you know, one of those things that you put the pans on, and it could be a stove, and there's, like, the... I don't know why you'd want them lit, really, because, well, I don't see why you, th like, I don't see why you'd want it lit. It doesn't seem like you'd want it lit, but, uh, you can choose whether you want it to face this way, or whether you want to make it face the other way, so that you can't see the thing. I kind of like it this way, because usually, like, stoves don't have edges like that, so this does look better. 
But yeah, and you can still make it lit, and then it has like the particles. So you could either have them be on or be off. <laughs> but anyway, next part, next tip and trick. Yeah, some dogs have two or more uh, tips and tricks for the these blocks. So the the second one, there's a third one, but the second one is this right here, and it is, and you can actually light up part of them here, which is really funny. You can like make some of them lit like you can make these <laughs> lit because it's the front of the the block but yeah but um point is basically um is yeah basically it's just like a you know it's supposed to be like kind of like a, a cool design for your ceiling i guess you could say so like not your ceiling but you're next to your ceiling at the top thing so it's like yeah, and so you can do it, the, you can like light, oh, okay, that's not working. But you can also like, you can't really see it, but you can also light these up, like make them lit, but you can't see it because the back of the thing doesn't change. But if you have like your lighting on, which is kind of why I turned it off so it could be less light if that didn't help, but you can kind of see it gets brighter when you do that. But yeah, anyway, point is you can either use the back of it or the front of it, so whatever you want. And the, the no, there are four designs on this. The third design is a microwave. So it's pretty simple. It just kind of looks like a microwave. Except when you do that, that's not quite how a microwave works. But, okay, wooden planks don't have any properties. But anyway, point is, uh, yeah, it's like just a microwave, you know. So it's got kind of like, kind of looks like buttons there. And then there's where you put your stuff in. But yeah, it looks like a microwave. So that could be another one. And the last one for this is as walls and again you can make them lit you can't really see this well you can kind of see that one whenever it's shaded you can do that to not not shade it but anyway point is you can have you can have some yeah you can make your walls out of it now i don't know you wouldn't i don't know when you would use this it wouldn't quite look normal you'd have to be like the right setting to do this like this kind of house doesn't look like you would these walls would work but and eh, whatever and now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go back because that's it for the smoker and we will now do the blast furnace so the blast furnace i was gonna do like you could think like that you could that you can make them lit, but you can't really tell they're lit. So you could have just random particles on. You're like, what are those for? But no, turn them off. We don't need random particles from the floor. But point is, they can look like vents in like an oil factory. So as you can see, this looks like an oil factory. It's got these some oil leaks and it's got pipes. But what's cool is it well, a it just uses the the blocks for the basically the everything. But what's also cool is that you can put vents in it without it just being, yeah, it's like interesting. And you can kind of make the vents all like lit up, which is funny. But what, what I was trying to say here is like you, when you make them, you can make them this side and the back or side of them is the normal, it's just a blank. It's just kind of just like the texture that we were using the whole time. Just normal. That's the back of the thing. Because if you, there's the other side, it does actually have the vent. Yeah, the back of these have vents on them, but you can't really see them because it's the back and you can't see that side. But yeah, so all of these have vents, but on the other side, you can't see. So this one, and you see, yeah, basically like these would actually have them on. It's like, don't, don't, don't. But yeah anyway point is you do this and then you make one of them face you and it's the same texture with a vent so that's kind of what we're doing here and um yeah so it's like it's kind of neat how that works but but yeah so that is that um i don't think okay i broke the door but anyway point is let's go back uh to the sneak peeks of everything Ooh. anyway let's go back to the to here so yeah that was the blast furnace to cut the bit the cartography table can be cool because it could be like i don't know like maybe some sort of light i don't know why you'd use this at all 
But it's like, I don't know, it could be a light. Now, the car talking for you about it, it's like, the, the, I mean, it has three, but they're like, eh, they're not very good. Because it's just kind of like, I've tried to use like the bottom of the texture, because that seems to be the best part. It looks cool, and it's got like this gold thing on it, kind of like the dark oak door. And it looks kind of dark oak, but the top of it just can't really be used as a decoration. Unless, except for just being a crafting table. So this was the best one out of them. Um, oops. Uh, it doesn't have any properties now. It doesn't do anything. But, yeah, maybe it has like some sort of drawer. And it looks like the bottom one isn't open, but the top one is. Top one's here just to cover up that there. But, yeah. And then the thing that over here... It was like disappears. Anyway, because I mean it. It's like for this. I don't know how you'd use this again, but like it's just like drawers you could open up at the top of a pantry or something or closet or whatever. But yeah, so that was. Is that three? Okay, yeah. So that was the very quick cartography table. I, there was not really anything for it that I could do. And the fletching table, smithing table, those were worse. I, there literally isn't anything you can do with them. Just nothing like it's they're literally just like a crafting table and you can just use them in your house and put them randomly you just where you put a crafting table and they'll look normal so i don't really need to go over them but yeah now next up we got grindstone so this is a cool a neat little block now gr the grindstone and the stone cutter are kind of going to be both in one kind of thing so i'm going to show them both at the same time basically but, uh, yeah, see, as you know, oops, I'm not on the slide. As you can see, that, as you know, these can, like, rotate and stuff. That could look cool or that. But point is, we got some, like, pillar designs here. So, this is, like, a pillar for the stone cutter. Stone cutter. I mean, no, not the stone. The, the grindstone. That's what this is. But, yeah, so you can do a lot of things. And the cobblestone wall. Eh. Make it invisible. Whatever you want to do with it. Yeah, it's just a funny thing you can do. You can make cobblestone walls invisible, and then you can't use them again. I think they're actually still here, though. Because if you do that, they appear. That's funny. You can make them invisible. But anyway, point is... Um, besides making cobblestone walls invisible... Uh, yeah, that's the stone cutter. That's just a kind of regular pillar with some stone cutters. Why do I call them stone cutters? I'm sorry. I keep stuck. St grindstone. They both have stone in their name, so I keep getting them mixed up. I keep calling it stone cutter. But it's grindstone, so I gotta get used to that. But yeah, anyway, so more grindstone stuff. As you can see, it's like. It's kind of like. It's like, I don't know what you'd make, but it's using the smooth stone, which is kind of the texture of it. And it kind of just makes like this like interesting little shape, and then it has the middle. I don't know. It was just kind of for fun. I had my brother on, he just made this. It's kind of, it looks cool. It could be used for like, I don't know, like a top or something. That wouldn't work. <laughs> but anyway, next thing, uh, the grindstone, not stone cutter, uh, is this. It's like, so it's just, I don't know, it's just like, kind of like this one where you go away, but <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Um, uh, great, now I can't, I gotta like do, 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 fix them up, get rid of the podzol. Well, anyway, the point is. Oh, great, okay. Um, so, point is. Yeah, this is like just another. Another neat one where it just kind of like. I don't know, it's just like a pillar. And you see, it kind of changes. So, it goes like that, and then it's on those, and it's on those, and it's on those. So, it kind of like works. But, yeah, that's just that one. Next up, we just kind of, I guess, I don't know why you do this. This isn't one supposed to be a pillar design. It's just kind of like, move it around, see what happens, and make stuff going. Okay, I'm going to stop doing that now. That's annoying. I got to fix it. But anyway, point is, and the, the, yeah, so the one that was supposed to be is like the skeleton skull. So it can move, I guess, if you're, if you want to, but, or does it do anything else? It doesn't do anything. There's no wall mode. Well, who cares? Yeah, anyway. But, yeah. Oh, it looks like he's, he took his head off. It, yeah, that's cool. Like, he took his head off. But point is, this is what I was trying to do. And it's just, like, kind of, like, I don't know. It's got legs. It's got a body with the stuff. And it's got a head. Whatever. 
Anyway, now it is stone cutter stuff. So I was thinking the stone cutter could do is, you know, be like, well, I couldn't really, I mean, there are a few designs for the top of it, but I was thinking the bottom of it looks like smooth stone, and if you use the stone cutter as the ceiling, kind of like the barrel one here, uh, it's basically the same thing, but you know, it's just like a different, it's just a grayer version, so it's like nice how you can see like, it's really cool how this thing works, um, but yeah, so it's like neat how it like, it like you could, could like go, it's like cool how like, I don't know, it's just like neat. Like I kind of like how you can make it any pattern. Like it could be a, the checker pattern, it could be lines, and it could be like a swirl, it can be anything you want. So that is really cool. And I just put more and more pillars and you can do that. You just, <laughs> anyway. Okay, so next stop for the stone cutter is like a pathway so it can kind of look like this um but if your stone cutter happens to be like this it could kind of look like bushes going up and um, like gray bushes if you're going like a dead garden why well, do you do, like dead bushes for that but also if you're wondering why i'm in a podzel world i made the world on halloween so i just thought well let's make it have podzel in it because it's halloween and now it's not halloween i can't change the world uh, so well, I guess I kind of could. I could just, like, go, like, get some grass out, you know. I just having a nice day getting some grass out, fixing this puzzle world. Do, 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 do. Gotta feel like a bajillion blocks. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing that. that. That would take way too long. As you could probably guess. <laughs> but, yeah, so, or could probably see, I guess. But, yeah. So, yeah, that's the stone cutter one. And a uh, stone cutter and... Um, stone cutter and uh, uh, grindstone, I guess. But yeah, back to the main area. So this one, the next one, uh, it's kind of it's the it's the bell. Now I don't I didn't really have a good one for this one, so all I kind of came up with was just like to make it have noise. So what I was thinking is like, well, it doesn't do anything right now. So I would think. Why don't we make it do something so when you power it, it should make a bell noise. I, I think you guys can hear that, hopefully. But it can make a nice bell noise. Can make a bell noise. I'm doing the pitch of the bell. Point is, you can hook it up to a, like a thing like this, and it goes. Okay, that's enough. But point is, yeah, that's cool. And then the other thing I found, I was watching at the start of the video, when you hit the use a debug stick and say face to wall it gets it's th it's this block as you you probably have seen it in your life before oh and it messes up the side uh oh and then it break why did it break that's funny it broke okay that's that's a bit weird probably because it wasn't on a wall oh i have no idea but point is you can make it like go on the wall or something and it doesn't work for some reason uh should i like if it does it actually work no okay i don't know it's 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 glitchy but but yeah point is it's supposed to be like some sort of like i don't know i don't know but yeah you can just do funny stuff and it's like a ceiling one but anyway no 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 i don't want you <laughs> i don't want it to be making noise all day and i can like connect it because well, that won't work I have to like do that. Okay, that works. And then, ding! It makes a noise, and I can not make it do it. <laughs> and then it went because it like attached or something, so I didn't realize it was there. Um, what happened? My game crashed. Wait, what? <laughs> Stop making noise. I'll just. Yeah, anyway, but that's the pill. That's just my suggestion. I feel like it should make noise when you power it with redstone, but they didn't think so. They just think it's a decorative block. Now, I think they'll actually have functionalities in the future. Um, but yeah, so next up we have, or, no, okay, not quite last. We have the lectern, which is probably the best one. Um, but yeah, so it has tons of things I can show you, and so does the loom, but yeah, anyway. So the lecture, I was thinking chairs, like, you know, 
I have a couple others, not just chairs, but yeah, so I was thinking like, okay, like seats, you know, so when you sit down at the table, it'd be like this, so you have like your seats and stuff, so you could either just go, <laughs> oh, sneak peek to the, the, the loom, anyway, point is, you could have the, the stone cutter, I don't know, not the stone, why am I getting all these names confused, I mean, I haven't known them for long, they're new, they're new, but, okay, so this is like a bench lectern idea, or something, I don't know what you'd do you just like sit or something it's like a chair and then we have one uh, more advanced one which is a back rest fancy and we have uh like a full-blown bench thing with a seat rest it's got arm rest got everything or you can just do singular ones if you want we don't want if you don't want big ones um but you guys do like mini ones but yeah so that's the kind of like there could be like seats um, I was also thinking, I don't know what it's supposed to be, but I thought it was kind of just looked cool. You put the lectern under the, some, some carpets, and it can, it, it sticks through the carpet. But I don't know what you can use it, and you can, like, you can make them, like, face any direction. So you can, like, do this, I don't know what you do, and then it makes this random stuff. Um, but yeah... Why doesn't it clear my inventory? I can't clear my inventory. Okay, that's a glitch. I can't clear my inventory. Like, it keeps, like... Now I cleared my Diga. Okay, that's weird. I don't understand what all this stuff is. But anyway, the point is... Glitches aside, as you can see, it's just like... Oops. Oh, yeah, they're slabs. But anyway, the point is, yeah, this is just a cool... I don't know what you'd use it for, maybe like a pool table. <laughs> but other than that, yeah, that's really it. Um, yeah. Oh, my game crashed. What's it doing? Why is it so laggy? What's going on? Where am I? Are they in? Okay, that was weird, but, um, anyway. This, uh, this, uh, lectern one is, like... Yeah, they, they can face different directions. Ooh. Uh, but point is, yeah, this one is supposed to, like, kind of like a red carpet, you know, because they have carpet, and you can put carpet in the middle. I don't know why you'd use that one. That's just me playing around. Oops. Um, but, yeah. So... But, yeah, so this one is, like, you know, you know, you got your regular smoking stuff. Um, I don't know what it's, it's that, what, what, you got, you got it on and everything, and it's all nice. Um, there we go. It's all nice, you know, with the exit, it's really top, and it's, no, what, what, so they're facing south, facing south, facing south, Okay. <laughs> Um, do, do, do. Okay, so as you can see, but the point of it with the lectern is that it's supposed to be like, do you call it a sunroof? I don't think you call it a sunroof. I don't know why I'm thinking it's called a sunroof, but maybe it is. point is, it's that thing that like takes in all the smoke and yeah, it just takes in all the smoke and like brings it up. So that could be what that is for. It looks really good way to do it. Uh, but yeah, other than that, it's pretty cool block. Oh yeah, one more thing. The ceiling could be it, and again, you can like rotate them a bit, like so it could be like sideways. It's weird what you can do, but you can make it a ceiling. And again, it's just like how I used it with the barrels. It's an outline. It has an outline bottom texture, which is really cool. And it looks um, well. I guess I kind of got rid of it from the top, but you, it can like make like <laughs> funny stuff. But anyway, point is that is the lectern. That's the point. Not of the whole video, but of the lectern part. Okay, now we go to the last thing, the loom. Uh, whoops, first, forgot to put the TP command in. But anyway, there we go. Now, so the first thing with the loom, I was thinking a piano. So, obviously, it could be... I can move it. <laughs> That's the only thing it has. But it could be, like, a piano, you know, piano keys. I'm gonna go in, like, adventure for this, but yeah, like... Can you look in? Okay, you can look in. But you're like... <laughs> Whatever, point is, you can like make it a piano, totally realistic piano sounds, by the way, and yeah, you can even have the, let me get up here, okay, you can even have uh, some, the strings in the back, which would be cool decoration too. So anyway, let's go on to what I kind of thought it was like. The 
back of it was like it was bookshelf right it's like like a bookshelf with no bookshelf in it so it's got you got your regular bookshelf and you got your oh yeah you can use the skits in there blah, 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 blah. okay so point is you got your regular bookshelves and you got some empty ones you're gonna have an empty column and you got a full full like bookshelf or whatever <laughs> but what i didn't quite think was uh what i didn't quite like was that uh well like they when they mix them together it doesn't look too good like like why well, so you can mix them together like okay okay i kind of like them i could use it but but you can see how the outline the like the the um well the top you can see how the top of uh or no the bottom yeah the bottom i think okay yeah the bo okay wait what is it? i think it's the bottom of the yeah the bottom of the loom block has two pixels going up the top only has one, which kind of makes it uneven. So you see there's a pixel there, but then there's books here. But other than that, it's kind of like, you can see how like, oh, oh, yeah. there's like some, it like you see it has a brown background and has a pink background here, which looks weird. But that could just be because like it's, sh the books are all like shading the, the pink background. So it looks dark because it's all like sh shaded. It's like got a lot of shadows in it. But uh, yeah, yeah. But yeah, that was it. But yeah, I was thinking like, so it doesn't look that good to me. But like, I, I mean, it's it's okay. But yeah. Now next up is the grill, uh, like a grill, uh, which is kind of neat. I kind of like the the grill. It's like it would be like obviously it's kind of what it looks like when you see it. A lot of people would probably think a uh, grill. Um. So yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Um. Unfortunately, the middle lines don't line up. But eh, whatever. What's that? I saw something. What was that? Was that like particles? I, I don't know what that was. That was really weird. I'm gonna have to like look at the fit. There was like a gray thing there. I don't know what that was. It's like a bloom. I don't even know. But yeah. Uh, it's so yeah. It could be a cool like a uh, neat little you know little, little grill or something. And next thing is like as I in your ceilings. So it could either be the back of it, which kind of looks like this. And it's like the bookshelf one, or it could be the front, which has its own like uh, thing designed to it. It's got like it's it looks cool, but and my game crashed. Wait, no, it's like slow. But yeah, I just think that it looks neat and cool. But yeah, uh, if you use the front and yeah, I kind of like the front, but or and the back. I kind of like them both, but for like the only thing. But you have to use like slabs and stuff, and also with the smoker one as well. But yeah. Anyway, next up, well, I guess we skipped one. We have a garage, which looks neat. I kind of like the garage one, but, yeah, it's kind of like, this looks like a garage. Wooden garage, better than using, like, iron, but, yeah. And the last thing is up. Yep, that's right. You can use them as ce ceilings. And it has this interesting, like, cartoony, uh, not shaded look to it. Because it's like, it just doesn't have like a shaded texture, which is, I kind of like it. It looks really cool. And so it could be used for a lot of things. A lot of neat things. Uh, sorry about that. Anyway, uh, yeah, so that about ends off the, vi well, not quite. There's a bit more. But other than that, that's pretty much it. But, so the last part was the crafting recipes. These are crafting recipe suggestions. Now, if you're watching this video in the future, crafting recipes will probably already be out, probably by the next snapshot, like, I don't know, 18W44B or something. But these are my suggestions for them, because as we're recording this video, they don't have any crafting recipes. Except the loom, that does, it's this, but... Anyway, let's start with the... Yeah, let's start with the lectern. I think it should be crafted like this. Uh, and you might be wondering, why did I use redstone here instead of red carpet? I was originally going to use it, and I had, but then I realized, well, actually, I realized, or then I, I remembered, I guess, I realized before, it's in the redstone tab, it's not anywhere, it's, the others are in the decoration, all the others are in, okay, that was a glitch, I like, anyway, all the others are in here, at the bottom of the decoration blocks, but the redstone, the lectern is in the redstone. That's So I was thinking that probably has to do something about redstone, I thought. So I didn't know. I don't know. But so I just thought, okay, let's make it redstone because it's still red. And it works because it's in the redstone tab. So I don't know what we're going to use redstone with it for. But we'll just have to wait and see. Maybe it was accidentally put in that tab. 
in that case it would be probably red carpet but yeah anyway the bell i think should be crafted like this so it's got the gold nugget for like the the thing in the middle that rings it's got the helmet for like the thing that makes up like the the thing that moves around oh whatever you kind of get they can they, you can kind of see how the helmet would have a good shape for it and then i have the slab for like the stick and then the thing right here um and I, the reason I didn't put them going down to the ground because it, because like when you put it on the ground that happens is because the item thing uh, is the ceiling one because it doesn't go down. So I just thought I'd make the crafting recipe could be the item. But yeah. Um, so the stone cutter I think should be crafted with three stone and a slab, a stone slab. Uh, the the this one should be the grindstone should be smooth stone because it looks like that and some oak logs or any i guess any kind of wood logs and then the the smithing table and the fletching table again i don't really have a good one so i just kind of thought like that and leather because i i think that texture is supposed to be leather but i don't know uh and then we got the archery one which is like the fletching table so it's got like bow and arrow because like that's on there uh, the tar cartography table is just like a map, a filled map, because that's what's on there. I don't really have good recipes for the crafting tables. I don't really have good designs for them either. Those are kind of hard. Uh, the blast furnace, or just full of cobblestone, so like bigger than a furnace. <laughs> Smoker would be that, but with some wood, because it kind of looks like it's got wood in it. So, put wood on the outside. And then the barrel, that's a barrel, should be crafted, I think, with two cobblestone for like the uh what? sorry two cobblestone for like the the things going around it and then another and then or then stripped oak logs for everything else and except the middle because it's hollow in the middle because you're putting items inside you will be able to but yeah that's about it for the video if you didn't enjoy the video don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more videos and i'll see you in my next one hope you enjoyed